Hello everyone, I'm Rom from the Rontom. Now I want to show you how to make Ferlex Evac in Adobe Muse. So I have you guys already open Adobe Muse and I want to explain first what is the Ferlex Evac. I want to get a sample from my template. Okay, so this is my template using Ferlex Evac. So this name is Bricks. If you need uh, this template, you can buy. So let's show the first what is Fralex Evac. So this is on the review. You see the background is static, but not move. And this is the call is Fralex, and we can check another. See. On this template, I'm used for like scrolling evac, so the background is still on the page. So, so this is the for like scrolling evac. Okay, we we will make it, and I will to show you how to make this evac. Okay. So we go back to in Adobe Muse. Have you already open? We will make for like scrolling here. First, you go to the leaf toolbar on in Adobe Muse. Go to click rectangle and make your rectangle here. We use image. Okay, make it position in center and don't forget to scale to feel and be sure your image is certain version wide and after you done go back to the feel on the top and go to the scroll and check this in motion and set to zero Final motion to on the zero. Okay, and we go back. You see, we have some scrolling here. We show on the browser preview. Okay, we'll show the product scrolling. Okay. So you see, this is the parallax effect scrolling. We try to make more. We go to back to rectangle, make it position. Okay. Okay. And we put in our image here, add image. <coughs> and then don't forget to scale to view, make each your screen always to responsive. Okay, so don't forget to go to scroll, check this on motion and make it zero and zero and done, okay? So we copy more to make more parallax image. Okay, we change the image and choose this one. Okay, so we have three image here with using parallax effect scrolling. Okay, we will show on the preview on browser. <coughs> okay. So this is the tutorial how to make forex scrolling in Adobe Muse. So I have you guys can make more and easy to follow on this tutorial. 
so thanks for watching my tutorial and don't forget to subscribe and if you need some template for your project or your portfolio you can go to my website have over more 60 template you can use on my template ready okay so thanks again